Mike for Wine Weirdos. Christopher here. We're checking out the Chateau Julienne. This is a Monterey County Merlot Private Reserve 2001. Did you, did you say uh, Bordeaux? No, I said Monterey County. A 2001 Monterey County Merlot. Guess where I found Interesting. it. Interesting. Grocery outlet. Close out, no less. <laughs> yes. And I can tell you right now, the nose is explosive. What is coming out? There's a slight wind. What is coming off the nose? Mm, yeah. It's just insanely rich licorice and like Herbs. vegetable. Herbaceous. Herbaceousness. Yeah, it's really nice. What a nose on this thing. Color, very garnet. What is it doing on the palate? It's almost black in color. And I really enjoy this wine. We're at the bottom of the bottle here. You I drank most of it last night. This has been open for about just with the cork on for about, you know, 18 hours, and it's just succulent fruit. It's really surprising. I mean, this is like a $5 wine. You talk about sediment. It is full of it, man. Mm -hmm. It's just coating the glass. Mm. I mean, it's almost got like, it's, it really mixes a new and old world thing. It has like a yes. high C grape punch thing going on. I think, I think it actually is leaning more towards a, um, or mo a more recent vintage, Old World, mm -hmm. on my palate, I'm getting tons of mushroom and olive textures, mm -hmm. along with just tons of licorice and cinnamon and herbaceousness. Mm. It is showing the tour of, of the, the California coast beautifully I right mean, now. to me, this just shows that if you seek and you're mm -hmm. willing to be adventurous, you can find awesome wine for under 10 bucks in yes. all sorts of places. And we drink a bunch of, you know, overpriced mm -hmm. bottles that we enjoy a lot, mm -hmm. but... This is delivery. For a, for a Tuesday night drinker, this was like such a treat. Really mm -hmm. good stuff from a Grocery Outlet and Chateau Julien, if they exist anymore, I don't know. So uh, we'll be back with more surprises here on Wine Weirdos. Cheers.